Alright! Good morning! Good afternoon! Good evening! Yes, this is Tragic Life, and we are going to play Pokemon Pika, or the yellow version. Um, I'm going to eventually try to go through all of the Pokemon games, because why not? I've never beaten any of them, um, and I have a very loose understanding and a loose interest in these games. I know they're classics and people love them. Um, but this is mostly because uh, I'm trying to do yearly a game specifically aimed for... Well, he wasn't my nephew-in-law last year. He's not this year, but he's going to be my nephew for real soon. F almost four months. So, without further ado, I'm going to try to get 100% here. Now, I don't know if, that, if I'm able to do that or not. We're going to find out. Um, <laughs> I will be giving a lot of information where all the Pokemon are, anything that you need to know, any extra pieces you need to know. Um, I've got a really in-depth guide here, so... <sighs> Hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor, or Pop, but we're going to call him Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for fights. Myself, I study Pokemon as a professor. Profession. Blah, 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 blah. First, what is your name? I'm just going to go with Ash. Just keep it simple. Ash Ketchum. Yes, I know who Ash Ketchum is. Right, so your name is Ash. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Um, what is his name again? I'm assuming his name in the game is Gary. Blue or John. Hmm. I don't have any rivals. Would be funny to use Steve's name. Steve might be a kick out. He's, that's my best friend in real life, as well as a farmer. He's, a, he's not a farmer. He is also a gamer on Twitch. Um, you can catch him at uh, What Would Gamers Do. He's, he's funnier than I am, I think. Uh, that's right, I remember now. His name is Steve. Ash. Steve and Ash. <laughs> his his fiancé, 11 years. Her name is Ash. That's funny. Oops. Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures. With Pokemon awaits. Oh, Let's go. So in the original version, you could choose between Bulbasaur, Charmander, or Squirtle. I do remember that. This one, you don't get a choice. Um, you start with... <clears throat> um, you start with Pikachu. Obviously, it's called yellow. Okay. Um, so there is a couple... There's a glitch called the Old Man Glitch. Um, I read it. I don't understand it. And I'll do some homework and maybe get it down and show you. Or I might not. I don't know yet. Okay. All right. Once you're in control, I'll head to the PC. Ash is playing the SNES. For those that do not know, that's the Super Nintendo. Okay, it's time to go. Ah, computer. Ash turned on the PC. We're gonna withdraw the potion. <laughs> All right. All right. Potions can be used uh, on a Pokemon in or out of battle. Uh, they restore 20 HP. If you use it during battle, it takes up a turn. So just be aware of that. Right, all boys leave home someday. It's I said so on TV. Professor Oak next door is looking for you. Alright. Okay, so we're gonna go Professor Oak's house. Alright, so actually we're gonna go this way first. Hey, wait, don't go out. 
That was close. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. Uh oh. It's a wild Pikachu! Pika Pika. <laughs> Alright, throwing a Pokeball. Hey, we caught a Pikachu! Okay, Pikachu was caught. Cool. A Pokemon can appear any time in, in tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for your protection. I know. Here, come with me. So I'm going to build a team of four, and I'm going to have two what's called mules. And I'll explain that when I explain that. It'll make sense, I promise. Oh, ain't that crazy. Alright, Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Hmm, Steve, why are you here? Alright. I said for you to come by later. Ah, whatever, just wait there. Look, Ash, do you see that ball on the table? It's called a Pokeball. It holds a Pokemon inside. You're gonna have to get me used to reading because I'm gonna I'm, it's gonna sound like robotic sometimes because the way the text is in this game. You may have it. Go on, take it! Hey, Gramps. What about me? Be patient, Steve. I'll give you one later. Okay. So do I. Hey! No way, Ash. I want this Pokemon. Steve snatched the Pokemon. Steve, what are you doing? Gramps, I want this one. But I... Oh! Alright then. That Pokemon is yours. I was going to give you one. Anyway. Ash, come over here. Ash, this is the Pokemon I caught earlier. You can have it. I caught it in the wild and it's not tame. I was there. When you caught it, you ain't gotta tell me you caught it in the lot. I was there. Do you want to give a nickname to Pikachu? No, I think we'll just keep Pikachu. You know, Pika Pika. Are we done? Okay. Um, so, in the red and blue, you get to choose between Bulbasaur. I think I said that already. Charmander and Squirtle. Um, and this, this guy has actually got ranks on where they are. The Bulbasaur is a rating B. Um, it starts with Razor Leaf. Um, but it has a limited move pool and can lag a little in the mid game. Uh, the Charmander is an A. Um, he doesn't match up against the first two gym leaders very well, but otherwise does well throughout the game. Uh, he picks up some strong early game TMs and Mega Punch and Dig. Squirtle is rated an S, so that's if, if you're playing the red and blue, pick the Squirtle. Uh, excellent typing, good early gym matches, access to great TMs. Uh, he's the best Pokemon for the in game run. The worst Pokemon in the set is Pikachu, sadly. Uh, decent early on against standard traders and, and learns the powerful Thunderbolt, but is useless against the first gym and falls, falls behind in power later. So, yeah. It is, because on yellow version, it refuses to evolve. Uh-oh. All right. Once you've received your first Mario Pokemon, save your battle, or save your game. Would you like to save the game? Yes. Ash, save the game. Not the world. Though. Wait, Ash. Let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. I wonder what I got. Okay. So this is kind of cool. Um, he has an Eevee. Now, based on how you play Eevee here, you can change how he changes in the future. If you lose this fight and skip the second one, he'll become a Vaporon. Water type. If you win one battle and lose or skip the other, it will evolve into a Flareon. If you win both, it will evolve into a Jolteon. So I'm just going to win both because why not? 
but we have Thundershot, which is what I'm going to use. Oh, he's stronger than me. Okay. I might end up losing. I didn't mean to do that. Can I go backwards? Well, I'm not going to win both, apparently, because I just got beat up. As you can tell, I'm not very good at this. It will get better. Pikachu fainted. Yeah, am I great or what? You won against me, kid. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Ash Grant, smell you later. Oh, it's definitely the nice. Is he Bart Simpson? What? Would you look at that? It's odd, but it appears that your Pikachu dislikes Pokeballs. You should just keep it with you. That should make it happy. You can talk to it and see how it feels about you. Okay. Okay, so we can't catch any Pokemon yet. We need Pokeballs. We're gonna go this way. We are gonna fight though, because I need to get my Pikachu back. Alright, we got a Ratatata. Ratatata. Hopefully, I can win this fight. We get lucky with Thundershock and actually, like, shock him and he won't be able to. Oh, he is gone. Yay! Alright, so which way am I going? Du -du -du -du. Right, we talked to this person. Hi, I work at Pokemon Mart. It's a convenient shop, so please visit us in Viridian City. I know I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Ash got a potion. I have a lot of people that would probably laugh at me a little bit for playing this game. See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town quicker than that way. It's gonna be nice, I'm not gonna have to edit. I'm saying that now I'm gonna get a little fight with the top of Alright, what are we going to do in Viridian City? Okay. I don't need to heal up my Pokemon. Alright, Northwest, where is my thing? Okay. So we're gonna go up and northwest. There should be a clump of bushes. Okay, it's right here. Ash found a potion, yay! I don't know why I sell it. Some items in the world can be hidden, as you saw. Okay. You can actually go to school here and learn some stuff. Um, status, conditions, blah, blah, blah. Alright, head inside Pokemon. Ah, there it is. Hey, you came from Pallet Town? Uh-huh. You know Professor Oak, right? Uh-huh. His order came in. Will you take it? to him? Uh-huh. Ash got Oak's parcel. Alright. Can I run? No, but I can jump. Up. Okay, I just got my... I just got Charlie's attention. He's like, what are you doing, Dad? Hey, bud. All right, we're gonna get in a fight. Yep. Don't be a Rattata. Don't be one. Yay, it's a wild pigeon. 
Well, he's level 4, so he's kind of strong. Ooh, he's not that strong. Critical hit. It's super effective. Pidgey Faint. Alright, so we're going to go back to Professor Oak. Oh, Ash! How is my old Pokemon? It's been like a minute, bro. Well, it seems to like you a lot. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. I mean, I haven't lost any fights outside of people. What, you have something for me? Yay, I delivered the oaks, the parcel. Ah, this is a custom Pokeball I ordered. Thanks, Ash. By the way, I must ask you to do something for me. Gramps, oh no, not again. Gramps, my Pokemon has grown stronger. Check it out. Ah, oh, Steve, good timing. I needed to ask both of you to do something for me. On the desk, there is my invention, Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Ash and Steve, take these with you. Ash got a Pokedex from Oak. I'm going to be creeping my own Pokedex here in person so I don't continuously fight the same bad guys. But I'll be doing it off camera. I'm just going to go ahead and get it ready. Only plot of a tata. I know I'm staying it wrong. I don't care. To make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't do it. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. All right, Grams, leave it all to me. Ash, I hate to say it, but I uh, don't need you. I know, I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one. Ash, <laughs> That's rude. Okay. Oh. Alright, we're gonna go to the rival's house, which is right here. We're talking to the sister. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Here, this will help you. Ash got a town map. So apparently, she ignored him or didn't listen. I don't know which one. So the town map is kind of useful. Oh, let's see. How, are you? How do I use it? Use the town map to find out where you are. Okay. Do I go here? Okay. So if you don't know where you're going, this is a really cool thing, I guess. Okay. So the first thing in this game that we can miss is coming up. Um, Be only in red and blue. I'm not sure. Hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'll be back. I'm gonna gain some levels here off camera uh, to get this missable item. Be right back. Alright, welcome back. So I changed my mind. Um, so the thing that, if you can get to level 11 um, and not buy any Pokeballs or capture any Pokemon uh, before you fight your rival the second time and win, uh, you'll get five free Pokeballs. Um, which is awesome, but we're going to go ahead and not do that because it's taken forever to level up. And Charlie's bugging me because he wants dad time. And Mrs. has got a little bit of a headache, so I'm going to go ahead and get off here. And, um, yeah, I'm going to start doing this Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, this is, <laughs> hopefully I'm going to kind of try to enjoy this. So until next time, adios, amigos, and uh, happy birthday, Jason.